don't be scared of the change. Scared to be the new kid. What's up, Lily Jane gang? It's your girl, Lily Jane here, back with another Metallica reaction. Now, y'all, this is my favorite part of the week when I get to react to Metallica. I'm so excited for this. But guys, I am also sad because the Ride the Lightning album, we're over halfway through it. There's only two more songs left on this album that I haven't reacted to. So guys, I need you to let me know down in the comments what Metallica album should I react to next and different singles, guys. But let's go ahead and get into this Metallica Fight Fire with Fire. shit oh wow i even muted it there so you guys i i was very sus in the beginning i was like what's going on here this isn't the normal typical metallica this is all peaceful it almost reminded me of weirdly the sound of music the musical i don't know why though but then so it was like peaceful kind of just vibe and then it went all thrasher raged oh what a day what a lovely day then the whole, the first beginning verse there, I'm assuming this is about war. You went from peacetime into war. And you guys, that's so cool to open a song like that because it keeps you on your toes. Yeah, other songs i don't think i've heard a song where james sounded like this but it reminds me of like garage punk but i weirdly love it and how they're talking about fight fire with fire i feel like with the way that the instruments are going right now you can literally feel like you're dancing in fire because of how fast it is it's like you're trying to keep up with the shit burning around you and i just i don't know i just love how much they bring their words to life with their freaking instruments <laughs>
mocking you, laughing at you as you take your last breath as you're about to be evaporated. Yo, Metallica got a sick sense of humor, and yo, I'm loving every second of it. Yo, that shit. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe they went there. I can't ignore it because now my brain thought of it and I have to share it with you guys. Okay, so how we're saying fight fire with fire here, and I know it's like, uh, it's kind of Metallica's way of saying it. it's kind of dumb to be in wars because you guys are just fighting fire with fire, you're not really trying to come in any solutions, you're just attacking each other. But then I got the imagery in my head. Could you imagine if like, there was like a house fire or something and then the fire department came to deal with the fire, they're like, you know what? I don't think so. Then it'll go out, could you imagine? Could you? I don't know, man. Maybe I'm just too stoned. But I just got that imagery in my head, and I just had to share it with y'all. <laughs> You guys, the ending there, the ending there really made the whole war thing come to life because it felt like a nuclear blast at the end and I've never heard anything like that at the end of the songs and I just, I gotta give Metallica kudos. Metallica's been around for a while, but they have shown me so many things in music that I've never heard, never experienced, never thought could happen. And I just love that about them because I listen to new music all the time and I just never thought a band from so long ago would be the one that's piqued my interest the most in 2022 y'all so guys again leave down in the comments an another metallica album i should check out after this one thank you again for watching y'all and have a great day guys